Hello, namaste, beautiful souls. I am recording this message coming to you from beautiful Kernville, California. And I wanted to speak with you all today about something that I'm experiencing, which is an acceptance of our gift. as a responsibility not only to ourselves and our well-being, but to all of those who've come before us as well. I've been connecting a lot lately with the spirit of ancestry and all of the storytellers and writers, not just in my line, and lineage, but in all of history, the carriers of the message who made great sacrifices in some of them, their own lives, to bring forward the messages that spirit was asking them to bring. And while to you it may not feel like your message is as important or critical or special or valuable as theirs I'm here to tell you that it is and that each of us has a role to play and that role involves the championing of the gift that we've been given that's really our only responsibility our responsibility is not to make it grander, not to try to save the world, not to try to <sighs> solve all the problems with our gift. Our responsibility is simply to devote our lives to the gift we have been given, to move beyond fear and accept this thing within us that needs to be expressed and accept it as enough because it is if it fills you with joy and it fills you with exhilaration and even though it's challenging you know that you would do it anyways That in your, in your darkest moments, you turn to it to help heal, to help process. It is your gift and it is valuable and it has purpose in the grand scheme of everything. And you owe it to yourself and you owe it to your ancestors and all of those who have paved this path for you to be able to do this, to uphold your purpose, to value it, to nurture it, to grow it, to push yourself past your self-doubt and your fear and your self-worth or lack of it, and to move forward so I offer you this prayer these words this invocation if you are ready for it put your hands over your heart and to breathe in this precious air that has been given to you I am here in this place and I ask now to be guided and led to understand and see the value of my gift. I call upon my ancestors 
and all of those before me. to aid me in this process of growth and transformation. As I uplift that which has been given to me, first to heal myself and then to share with the world so that it may heal as well. I ask to be shown the value and the purpose of my joy and to accept my role, however large or small it may be. And I thank you for the opportunity to live in joy by expressing my joy and thus multiplying and increasing the joy on this planet. I am devoted fully and completely. Despite my fears and doubts, I am devoted to this path. Thank you for this gift. Thank you for this life. Thank you for this joyful expression. I accept my gift now. I accept my role now. And I thank you for the chance to be here, to share it with others. You are beautiful, you are special. Your creativity is your path to healing, to freedom. Your joy is what you are here to do. And I hope that you will participate and engage that joy today and every day in some capacity, no matter how small. Mother Nature agrees. This is what we're here to do. Live it. Because amazing things will start to happen. And doors will begin to open. Yes, you will be challenged. You'll be pushed to face all the things that had stopped you before. But you will be victorious. Because you have committed your life. You have devoted yourself to being there for yourself and expressing yourself and that's all you need to do and then just wait and watch as everything forms around you it'll be beautiful you are gifted you are talented if you're watching my channel then you have something within you that needs to come out and I want to help you do that so Join in the conversation, either it's here on Instagram or YouTube or wherever you are. Um, let's work together. That's what I envision for Awakened Creators. I see it as a community. A community of beings who understand the value of creativity and are devoted to a life of creativity, whatever that expression means for you. So let's continue the conversation. You can leave a comment and I will get back to you. I love you all so much. Namaste.